here we have a TLP audio TDA10 digital to analog converter. You are looking at the front panel. There are three items on the front panel. The input selector switch for four different inputs. The amber power indicator and the green signal lock indicator. When there is signal from any of the inputs where it has been selected, this green LED will light up. On the rear panel, we have the inputs on this side, the output in the middle section, and the AC power cord input on this side. There are four inputs. Toslink optical input, RCA jack SPDIF input, XLR jack AES EBU input, and the optional USB input. The output we have the RCA single ended output. The top is the left channel, the bottom is the right channel. And then we have the XLR balance output. Again, the top is the left channel, the bottom is the right channel. This is the AC power cord input. In order to connect the TDA10 into your system, you will need to connect any or all of the input into your source. Connect your output to your preamp or integrated amp via the single-ended output and or the balance output. Then you connect the AC power cord. Please note, as soon as you connect the AC power cord, the unit is on. It is best to connect the input and output and then place your unit onto a shelf before you connect the AC power cord. When everything is connected, make sure the amber power indicator is on and then select your input. When you see the green signal lock indicator light up, it means there is signal at the input where you have selected. At this point, there should be signal at the output to your preamp or integrated amp and you can turn up the volume control slowly. The music should start playing. 